Hello, my name is Jennifer Frias Gonzalez. I'm the director of the Little Disciple Learning Center located in the Church of St. Bernard. Today, I would like to welcome you to our center via our virtual tour. I hope you enjoy. The Little Disciple Learning Center was founded in 2010 by the executive director, Father Robert Morris. The Little Disciple Learning Center is committed to providing quality early childhood education. Our purpose is to provide an atmosphere that encourages social, emotional, physical, and intellectual growth and development of the child as a whole. Our nurturing teachers and staff will encourage learning through play, as well as through carefully planned learning activities with specific learning goals. The Little Disciple Learning Center is composed of five universal pre-K classrooms and a pre-K-3 classroom. The pre-K-3 and universal pre-K classroom 1 are located on the first floor of the building, and the universal pre-K classrooms 2 to 5 are located on the second floor. Our classroom ratios are from 8 to 1, with a classroom capacity of 16 students and 2 teachers, a New York State certified head teacher, and a teacher assistant. Our hours of operation are from 8.30 in the morning to 2.30 in the afternoon. We currently offer early drop-off starting at 7.30 in the morning and extended day until 6 p.m. During early drop-off, the students engage in center activities and table toys, while in extended day, the students can continue to develop their gross motor skills in the gymnasium or the park. The students also participate in a classroom lesson that reinforces what they are learning during the day. Big Day for Pre-K is the major curriculum used in our universal pre-K classrooms that prepare our students to enter kindergarten. Big Day offers learning experiences and materials that support our students' social and emotional, academic, and physical development. It is composed of eight monthly themes that include weekly and daily lessons with whole group instruction, small group instruction, and learning centers where the students learn through play. It builds upon students' curiosity and interest and encourages them to explore, play, and learn about the world around them. Big Day for Pre-K provides a collection of children's literature that guide classroom lessons and conversations for language and early literacy development. It uses a technology component that connects children, teachers, and their families to the curriculum. Our Pre-K-3 classroom focuses on a curriculum that is established by monthly themes. The students create arts and craft lessons that reinforce what they are learning during the day. The Pre-K-3 classroom also provides a religious education component, read out louds, dance and music, smart board activities, and computer activities. Students' literature skills are also reinforced with book challenges. The American Reading Company has created an independent reading program that's goal is to develop avid lifelong readers who become proficient in reading and develop a love for reading. Students are provided with a book bag with about four to five books as well as a reading journal. The goal is for the parents to read the books with the students at home every night, having conversations about the stories and or the illustrations in the books. This has been a great experience for the students and their families. It has not only developed the students' literacy skills, but also created a reading routine at home for the families. A typical day at the Little Disciple Learning Center begins at 8.20 a.m. for student drop-off. Due to the current pandemic and cold weather, students are being dropped off at the door. Every classroom is assigned a specific door of the building, which allows us to follow appropriate distancing between classes. Teachers greet the parents at the door for COVID screening, temperature checks, hand sanitizers, and student sign-in information. Now that we are approaching nicer weather, we will begin to have drop-off in the main parking lot. The parking lot will be close to incoming traffic and each classroom will have an assigned location where parents will follow the same COVID screening protocol before the students enter the building. When students enter the building, they will go to their assigned bathroom for hand washing and disinfecting, followed by the unpacking of their personal belongings. Each student is assigned a closed cubby that they use to put away their backpacks, jackets, blankets, change of clothes, and any information going home to the parents. The students then enter the classrooms and begin their day with table toys. Students can play either independently or with a classmate. And during this time, teachers encourage conversations to develop students' language skills. Following, we will have morning meeting. During morning meeting, the students sit on the rug and learn about topics such as the calendar, the weather, colors, shapes, numbers, and are introduced to the day's topic with a question of the day. The students are then paired with a classmate to discuss the question and then share. Tommy, what month it is in our whole sentence? Roman, what month is it? It is March. Very good. Everybody, it is March.
Morning meeting is then ended by foundations. Foundations is a phonics, spelling, and handwriting program in which the students learn letter and sound recognition, as well as identifying words that begin with the letters of the alphabet. Once the students are familiar with the upper and lowercase letters, they are then introduced to the formations of the letters. The students are provided a healthy snack before they begin the main lesson of the day. Teachers disinfect the tables and the students go wash their hands as they prepare for snack time. Parents receive a snack calendar every month with the information of the snacks that the students will be having each day. Big Day for Pre-K is composed of three main lessons, Big Experiences. Big Experience 1 is conducted earlier in the day and focuses on small group instruction and center time, while Big Experiences 2 and 3 have story time and whole group instruction. The student's work is displayed in the classroom and in the hallways and is then sent home for the parents. Following the first big experience, the students are given about 45 minutes of gross motor time. When the weather permits, the students are taken out to play in the park. The park is first disinfected before the students can play, and only one class at a time is allowed to play in the park. During inclement weather, the students play in our indoor gymnasium. The students there have a variety of toys and games that they can use during their time in the gym. Due to the pandemic, the students are currently having lunch in their classrooms. Before the pandemic, the students were having a family-style lunch in our cafeteria. The lunch is provided by the school district of White Plains, and parents receive a monthly lunch menu at home. The students are allowed about 45 minutes to an hour for nap time in the classroom. The students are not mandated to nap during this time, but they can take this time as quiet time to rest. At the end of the day, the students that participate in the extended day program transition to the first floor with the extended day teachers and the rest of the students prepare for dismissal. The students are picked up by the pickup person and signed out at the same door that they were dropped off in the morning. The teachers then go back to the classrooms to disinfect the tables, chairs, and toys. The teachers first disinfect with a soap and water solution, then a Clorox and water solution, and finally steam with alcohol and water. Thank you for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed our virtual tour and we hope to see you in September.